Okay, here we have a jar that I just filled up with acetone and a bunch of dud blanks from my casting experiments. You can see a little bit of leftovers in from the last time I did this, but uh, just plugged them in. It'll probably take a day or so before all the, the resins come off of them, but no work. I'll come back later. Okay, it's been roughly 24 hours now since I put these in here. And if you look in here, you can see that the, the resin has really disintegrated from a little, little teeny tiny pieces. I mean, some of it's still on the tubes, but a lot of it is just slothed off. And I mean, you can see bare tubes in there. I'm going to empty it out and then I'll show you again what's left. Okay, I've strained off, you can see here, uh, I've strained off the the acetone, which has turned a lovely purple now because of all the, the paints and everything that's had to absorb. Uh, the tubes and resin, you can see there's not a lot left. And this is just after 24 hours. If you leave it in here a couple days, uh, you can basically turn the, the resin into mush in the bottom of it. I don't like letting it set that far because it contaminates the acetone too much. Uh, and you cannot you, know, you can only use reuse the acetone uh, uh, for a couple sessions that way if you do it 24 hours you can reuse the acetone as, as long as you've got acetone left uh, so now I'm gonna pick through here real quick and see if I can get most of the tubes out and see if there are any that need to be uh, put back in for longer so after uh, 24 hours I've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven tubes that are all pretty clean and two that didn't the resin didn't fall off all, all that well uh, one came about half clean the other one didn't do very much at all sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't but for the most part you can see it works I didn't have to do anything other than literally dump them into acetone pick them out and wash them off and by the way all the resin and stuff that I removed is a pretty healthy cup here so you can see how effective that was for no work okay so I'm gonna load up my next batch and have a go at it again and this time there's that white is uh, aluminite I've not tried to do this with aluminite before so it's gonna be the first time to try it with this so now I've got the next batch all loaded up ready to go and you can see right there one of the two tubes that didn't uh, come all the way clean the first time uh, threw both of them back in here to see if they'll finish up the aluminite down there on the bottom, the rest of them, dud blanks, ready to be cleaned. I'll see you in another 24 hours.